We're at the Busy Beaver Button Company. It's a museum, it's a company, it's incredible. Kristen Carter's here, the owner and co-proprietor. Wow, just wow. Yeah, thank you for visiting. How'd all this start, Kristen? So I started Busy Beaver Button Company when I was in college and I was in a punk band and no one was really making punk buttons, like the little one inch buttons at the time. And then I started the Button Museum about 14 years ago to show as much American history as possible through pinback buttons. How many buttons do you have in the collection of the museum? Do you have a number? Yeah, the collection has about 50,000. 50,000 different buttons. Yep. What here in the museum is like the oldest button you have? This is from 1789. Whoa. This is for George Washington's inauguration. Whoa. Is that for real? People were like, hey, we started a country, let's make souvenirs, and that's what this one is. You know, you know so much about buttons and you have so many buttons here. You should probably write a book about buttons. I don't know why you wouldn't. Well, I did. What? It's called Button Power. Oh, that's excellent. The thing that's cool about buttons is that they cover a lot of history yes. from like a people's perspective. Yeah. So there are a lot of things that I learned about that I would have not known otherwise. Kristen, both Toonie and myself are giant cartoon fans. Yes. I'm a cartoon curator. Toonie is one of the biggest cartoon fans Big of all fan. time. So do you have a bunch of cartoon only buttons that we could see? Absolutely. Cartoon buttons are been around since the very beginning. Love to see them. So Kristen, with the cartoon buttons, they're, they're made for kids, but adults could certainly wear them. Why not? Why not? What adult wouldn't wear this uh, What's Up doc? Oh, that's Bugs Bunny. These buttons were made in the 80s, but it's uh, That's All, folks. Porky yeah. a Pig. I love Porky Pig. He kind of reminds me of Bill sometimes. Yeah, he's my role model. Do you like Wiley Coyote? I do. He's a, he's a hot cup of coffee, you know what I mean? And he's never going to win. Let's you never know what you're getting with Road that. Roadrunner is always going to beat that son of a gun. You know what my first button was? What? My belly button. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Get out of here. you owe me $5, Tuni. <laughs> Why don't we do that button? It.